All right, I've got another boiler here. I'm gonna put it on eBay. A really nice antique gauge on it. Pop-off valve is set at 100 pounds, so it's gonna go off here in, anytime it's at 90 now. Steam whistle, water sight glass, hand pump, and injector. And a couple blow-down valves there on the side. And it's got a blower on it. It's got a ring inside of it, but turn on this valve here. And a lot of air comes through the fire. The validator is just kind of floats along, but it's just fine. Does a really good job. Uh, draft door down here, of course, and and ash pan. And the hand pump works really good. Just pumps water right into the boiler. Oh, little container there. This is a airlock valve here. Once you all your air is out of the line coming into it and then just close that off and pump it. And I'll attempt to try and get the boiler or the injector to work here. A little valve here at the top. Okay, she's now working. Let's get all the water up from the pot here. And you can see that water level is going down. All that water is going into the boiler. And of course, you don't want to kill your fire too much, so you can see the sight glass there, it's going up in the sight glass. So it's going down quite a bit. I'm just going to shut it down now. That works good. Now I put a bunch of water in it so the pop-off valve probably won't go on off at 100 pounds so the pressure has gone down to about 80, 75 or 80. Real nice boiler. It's a 16 inch diameter. The boiler itself, 16 inch diameter, 38 inches tall. Overall with the base it's 72. It's big enough to run some big steam engines. And this is your out right here, or I have a, a bigger one on this side, a half inch out, steam out, for uh, you know, running the engine. Well, that's about it. The base doesn't go with it, that rolling cart there at the lifting table. I've got to keep that. I'll strap it to a pallet. You can see the pallets over there just waiting for it. Strap it to a pallet and uh, ship it off. I'll take it down to uh, one of the shipping companies, shipping terminals. And I'll get it on eBay. Popped off at 100 pounds. Going down to about 80, 90, 95. Looking real good. And it will uh, stop at around 75 or so.
Yeah, for all you guys that need a big boiler to run your engines, this is it. And 75. And with coal in here, or firewood, my pieces are 8 to 10 inches, 12 inches long. The inside of the boiler's, oh gosh, 16 inches almost on the ID. And you just pipe in a pipe to that half inch pipe there to go to your engine and you'll have uh, good steam. And if you only got is a air compressor, this is a great little unit here. Look for it on eBay.